Hello everyone, this is Mark Brand from Alpha Controls, one of Canada's leading suppliers of measuring, sensing, and controlling instrumentation for a variety of different industries such as pharmaceutical, aerospace, cannabis, food and beverage, just to name a few. Today we're talking about the triple point of water. The triple point of water is used in the fixed point calibration of your primary temperature standards and is arguably the most important point in the ITS-90 scale. Let's go to the lab and I'll show you what I'm talking about. Here at Alpha, like many of you, we perform comparison calibrations. We use a bath, a probe, and a readout device. We're also one of the only labs in Canada that can do a fixed point calibration over the range of minus 196 up to 660. And we utilize our triple point of water cell every day. By monitoring the triple point of your primary temperature standard, you're able to catch any drift in between calibration cycles and then take immediate action if required. For example, if you calibrated 500 probes and then you found out at the end of your calibration cycle that you had a problem with your probe, you potentially would have to go back a year and recall. Here at Alpha, we monitor our probe every week. Therefore, if we had a problem, we only have to go back one week to capture any probes that might have been done within that period. Some of you might ask, why my probe would drift? I store it properly, I put it back in its case. What you might not realize is these probes can be damaged from the slightest impact and even from daily use. I realize that many of you think that this doesn't fit into your budget because you don't do primary temperature calibrations. But when considering the cost of a recall due to your probe drifting, the investment really starts to make sense. If you have any questions about the triple point of water or any other calibration questions, please feel free to reach out to us. Don't forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel so you don't miss out on any of our upcoming episodes. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you on the next episode of Brands Brands.